Chapter 1. My Life My life is a notebook, and I am the author. When I was born, my notebook started off blank. Since my childhood until now, I've recorded so many memories of happiness, fear, sadness, laughter, and joy. My notebook is a record of my life and things I've done and learned in life so that others can learn from it. Chapter 2. My Foundation My family is my foundation, where I draw my strength from, learn my values, go for shelter, the reason to succeed, and my biggest treasure. My parents will always be my guide. I got my intelligence from my mom and my athletic ability from my dad. Every moment in my life, alongside my parents, has been a blessing and I'm always learning from them. Chapter 3. My Goals My goals are very straightforward. Work on what I love, earn success, and be proud of what I do. I was taught by my parents to have an ambitious mind. I reach for any goal despite any adversity. I vision myself having a strong character with a life of good health, a successful career, and a safe home which I built for my future children and wife. Chapter 4. Baseball Field The happiest place on earth for me is the baseball field. Since I was 4 years old, I've only played baseball. The baseball field somehow always makes me happy. All my frustrations and emotions go away when I step on a field. I could be having a terrible day, but once I step on a field, all of it goes away, and all I focus on is baseball. Chapter 5. My Mom Most people are influenced by famous people like Mike Trout or Michael Jordan, but not me. I'm influenced by my parents, but mostly my mother. My mother has raised me to be the man I am today. I wouldn't know what to do without my mom in my life. Without my mom's love and support, I'd be a totally different person that no one would be proud of. Chapter 6. Mistakes. No one is perfect. Mistakes make a person grow because it teaches lessons on what to do right. I made many mistakes and I learned from every single one of them. I will never repeat the mistakes I've made because I will know what will happen if I do. Chapter 7. My Parents All parents want their kids to be successful and nothing makes them more happy. That's all my parents want for me. My parents always taught me to follow my heart and my dreams and that's what people should do. Also, they've taught me that any dream can come true with passion, dedication, and hard work. Those are the elements of success. Chapter 8. Struggles and Obstacles Overcoming struggles and obstacles is a part of life, especially for a teenager. When you're a teenager, you don't exactly know what you're going to be when you grow up, or what you want to be. You are still figuring it out. Chapter 9. Optimus 
An optimist is a person who has positive thoughts and standpoints on life. Optimist is a way of positive thinking. An optimist is the perfect way to describe me. You can almost always find me in a good mood to the good and bad times. It's a waste of time dwelling on the bad sides of things when you can be thinking positively and being happy. Chapter 10. Life. Life is full of ups and downs. It doesn't matter how many times you fail or how many mistakes you make because the purpose of failure is to teach you how to grow and be persistent. In order to achieve success, you first need to set some goals and go get them. You can't wait for success to come to you. You have to go and find it on your own.